Um, what's the question? What do men? What women? What annoys you? As a as from a woman, what is mm-hmm. a woman? About what women. does a woman? What annoys you about yeah, a woman? Like, what does a woman does that annoys you? Breathe. Now I'm fucking around. Wow. Um. Wow. Now I'm fucking around. What a woman does that annoys me is if we in any kind of situation, friendship, relationship, marriage, engagement, whatever the fuck it is, if you don't allow me to be unfiltered around you, mm-hmm. that's mm-hmm. annoying. Boxing me in. If I chose you to be my everything, to be my it, or even to be my girlfriend, whatever the fuck it is, that means I have a certain respect for you that I don't have respect for these little women. I may respect them, but mm-hmm. I want you. Right. So if you don't allow me to be whatever the fuck I am around you, why the fuck are we even together? That breeds resentment. That breeds all this other shit. Another thing that annoys me about women, I don't like when women don't have that one friend. And when I say that one friend, I mean that one friend that will literally tell them, shut the fuck up. When they need to hear it. When they I need to hear it. I keep it honest. Oh, I got those oh, friends. I need a woman, my woman, to have that friend that when we in that stupid ass argument from the 80th time, she's not saying, yeah, girl, you know, that nigga's stupid because that girl's probably single and bitter. Have those friends. I don't give a fuck, but I need you to have that one friend that's like, shut, relax. Okay. That nigga is the best thing that ever happened to you, my nigga. Do you need to do I, That annoys me when you don't have that one friend. That's about it. I can go into more, but I know it's yeah, about it. It's, it's tolerance with me. You don't it's the energy. Me. Like, I can have one woman here that uh, she can be corny and just say corny jokes and the shit won't bother me. And then I have another woman here. She says corny jokes. I'm like, shut Get the, the fuck, fuck away from me. Fuck up. Like that shit was hard. <laughs> Feeling a role. So it, it's like it all depends on bully my Feeling tolerance. Yeah, it all depends if I if I I like you or not. If I vibe with you, if or not, if I'm annoyed or not. So I can't say because every, something every woman does this, the shit may not annoy me. Yeah, you do this that annoy me. You do this that doesn't annoy me. The shit doesn't go through. What <laughs> annoys you the least? That's what it is. Nah, it, well, it do, it all depends on that woman. Some, exactly. Like okay, like. You can have a, a woman that's not attractive, but has amazing sex appeal. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. So when yeah, she does that, sex, that so when she does sexy shit, okay. it won't it won't annoy you. You won't the be sexy annoyed shit is attractive. Sexy shit. Really? Yeah. But don't. But wear you your, can have somebody but, that's. But don't ab- wear your regular face. <laughs> but you can have somebody that's absolutely beautiful and, no and has no sex appeal. Yeah, and when she tries to do something sexy, you're like, stupid. Sit your clumsy ass <laughs> down. Sexy, sexy nah. is a fucking. She slipped and fell. <laughs> trying to dance. So for there's you. The, the, there's a difference. So that's why I say it I've all depends there, on this. Okay. Shit. So I now. I don't want to go there. <laughs> okay, I got into a um. I laughed. You still answering? Yeah. Yes. Now I was down. I'm gonna go to the next question. You got something to get something to get off your chest? One simple. One simple question. Yes. One question. Yes. Believe women think with emotion, whatever. I'm. Facts. My logical thinking is on 300%. We know percent is out of 100. So I'm way above that. <laughs> my, my, my thing is, if you're going to say something to me, if we're talking about something and we disagreeing, not having an argument, we disagree with something, and I tell you why I feel away, and you tell me why you feel away without a reason, that's the most annoying shit in the world. And it's something my intelligence. So not like you're gonna lie to me. You're gonna lie to me thinking. Yeah. You're gonna lie to me thinking I'm not intelligent enough to know that you're lying. Mm. I'm not gonna say nothing, but it's gonna piss me the fuck off because I know you're lying to me. You don't like liars. Okay, Dave. Um, was, yeah, that's, that was, to answer your question, I wanted to respond to what Dave was saying. What was the question again? Yeah, that is what do women do that annoys you? So to answer your question, right? Any day now. A lot. <laughs> like what? All right, 21. I'm going to start vague, then I'm going to just dull it down, I'm going to do it quick, because I know these are quick cut answers. Mm-hmm. Always judging. Always most, not saying all, I'm speaking for most. So I'm going to give it the, you know, some of these answers is going to go towards certain women. It's not, it's not for every woman. It's not for all women, right? So one is always like judging. Yeah, men and women compare, but I personally feel like women compare a lot more than men do. I, mainly because of the whole emotional, mainly because of the whole emotional aspect of it. Now, another, that's, those are things that annoy me. Another thing that annoys me is women who, Women who still think 
that men are just supposed to do everything. That's like number one on the list of top annoying things ever. Women who feel like men are supposed to still do everything. For me, that's a dub. That's a no-no. Like, Can you describe everything though? I would literally- Tell me what you mean by everything. Cause, Cause I want to hear it. Like when I say everything, I mean the. When I say everything, I mean the things that are from the old age. You know that men are supposed to just pack up and carry everybody on their back. You know, like yo, we living in a time where shit ain't cheap, bro. Like, I can jump in on this. Shit ain't cheap. You know, so as that annoys me. Women who women who feel like they're just supposed to be handed everything and. You know, it's like that's not how this works. If you're gonna, if you're gonna, if you feel that way, you at least have to be contributing to a man. Period. Like for me personally, women who Dave, can I learn you something? No, nah, hold on, hold on, because you gonna make me lose my train of thought. Women who now to basically answer, I know people are probably thinking like, yo. Um, to elaborate on what I'm saying. So pretty much everybody knows that women feel men are supposed to provide. Women, are, women feel men are supposed to protect. Women, to, you know, women feel like men are supposed to like, just be the breadwinner, supposed to be the ones doing everything. That annoys the fuck out of me because in this day and age, just because I make more money than you doesn't mean that I'm gonna fucking do everything. I seriously, I don't give a fuck if we're in a whole relationship. I'm not doing shit. I will come home with my bread and you won't know I have any money. Oh. Like, you feel me? That annoys me. Oh, wow. Women who don't feel like they need to do shit. And there's a difference. There's a difference when I say women that don't feel they need to, just to clarify that, okay. they don't feel they need to be the one to do the grocery shopping. They don't feel like they need to cook. They don't feel like they need to fuck me. Like, Ooh. you feel me? Like, when I, I'm tired at a long day at work, you feel me? But you feel like I need to come home and I need to provide this. But let's not forget, like, I have my needs as well. Gotcha. You feel me? So pretty much that's the only thing that annoys the fuck out of me. It's just women who just feel like the old age shit is still on the table. Nah, that's annoying. What's up, everyone? It's Jesus Prince. I hope you like that video. I really hope you like that video. We have a whole lot of videos on our channel. Make sure y'all check them out. Make sure y'all like, make sure y'all comment, make sure y'all subscribe. Share your video with some friends. Yo, I'll see you next week. See you next show. Let's go.